Welcome to the RV Kitchen, where we share our journeys and cook our way around America. Today's journey is from Crane Hot Springs to Boise, Idaho. It's a little over three hours, 180 miles across eastern Oregon. After a couple of days at Crane Hot Springs, it's time to continue east. I take a left out of the entrance onto Highway 78, and then at the town of Crane, turn left onto 478. I rejoin Highway 20, about 18 miles east of Burns. Taking this route means I will miss about 12 miles of Highway 20 between Burns and where I rejoin it. It is leg three of the Highway 20 journey. Just left Green Hot Springs and reconnected onto Highway 20 headed east. It is a beautiful day, 75 degrees outside, sunny. Next stop is Boise, Idaho, so headed east. For the next 100 miles, Highway 20 travels through beautiful countryside. After climbing out of the foothills of the Stinkwater Mountains, the road winds its way along the Mayala River, passing through Hontura, Harper, and Vale. Hontura is Spanish for juncture and the community was named for its proximity to the confluence of the Mala River and the North Fork Mala. In 2021, the population of Harper was only 120 people, so that gives you some idea of the perspective on its size. In this part of Oregon, the main business is hay and cattle, and it's a long road between some very small farming communities. From Harper, the road moves to the city of Vail, about 12 miles west of the Idaho border. It's the Mala County seat, the first stop in Oregon for the Oregon Trail, and Vail came into being around 1870, when Jonathan Keeney built the Reinhardt House, which still stands today. At Vail, Highway 20 and Highway 26 become one road and proceed on to Cairo, before turning south, passing through Nasa, Palmer, Notice and merging with I-84. In Coldwell, Highway 20 separates from I-84, but despite setting the route, the navigation system takes us around exiting at Garden City and then backtracking northwest on Highway 20 to finally land at Boise Riverside RV Park. A complete contrast to the section of Highway 20 that runs between Bend and Burns. This portion of Highway 20 goes through river valleys and lush farming before landing in the metropolis of the city of Boise. Be safe, share the road, and enjoy America from the highways and the scenic byways. You can catch us in the kitchen at rvkitchen.tv on the web and follow our journey on Facebook and social media as we cook our way across America.